What we found is that uh, if you take the donor T cells and you incubate them ex vivo in rapamycin, the T cells, as long as you provide other uh, survival factors such as co-stimulation and cytokine support, uh, the T cells instead of dying will be able to overcome the rapamycin effect and to survive the culture system. So it's a way, rapamycin uh, inhibits an enzyme called mTOR and mTOR is very important because cells rely on this to grow. Uh, mTOR needs to be active for cells to grow and proliferate and if it's blocked by rapamycin the cells will essentially undergo a starvation effect. So kind of paradoxically we're starving the cells ex vivo uh, but during that starvation we're giving them other signals to keep growing uh, and cells can survive that under the right conditions and when they do survive that they emerge as a more healthy cell somewhat paradoxically.